In northern Syria, the 17th Division maintained its headquarters near the city of Raqqa, where it directed operations all over northeastern Syria. In March 2013, a coalition of rebel forces captured the city of Raqqa, with government troops withdrawing to their well-fortified headquarters. For more than a year, this remained a bastion of government control in a sea of rebel territory. In January 2014, fighters of the Islamic State took full control of the city. With much of Syria's northeast under its sway, the Islamic State turned its attention toward a number of government army bases, foremost among them, the Division 17 base outside of Raqqa. The main buildings on the base are comprised of the Division Command, the Housing Complex, and the Agrar Battalion. A wall surrounded the base's perimeter, though sections of it had already been destroyed in the previous year's fighting. Approximately 640 Islamic State fighters participated in the battle, while the government maintained an estimated garrison of around 300 soldiers. Under a rolling barrage of artillery and rocket fire, a Saudi suicide bomber sped toward the perimeter wall, intending to blow a hole in the defenses. Waiting nearby, 40 infiltrators had stealthily crept up to the wall and were waiting to exploit any fresh opening that could be made. As it neared the perimeter, the vehicle was targeted by several Syrian gunners, and one lucky shot managed to ignite the explosives and blow up the vehicle before it could reach its objective. A second Saudi suicide bomber driving a truck attempted an attack, but was also destroyed well short of its intended target. Fighting raged around the base as fighters of the Islamic State attacked from three directions, spearheaded by the infiltrators, who used the suicide bombers as a distraction to slip into the base. ISIS forces surged forward, killing 16 soldiers, but failing to overwhelm the defenders. Jets and helicopter gunships pounded Islamic State positions around the base and in Raqqa. Over the next two days, the attacks intensified, and on July 26th, the Syrian army fought its way out of the base and fled north, splitting into four groups. One group acted as a rear guard, covering the retreat, while two others, numbering around 200 men, managed to reach their Brigade 93rd base and Ain Isa. On its trek north, the fourth group was caught in an ambush, with 50 men captured and summarily executed their heads put on spikes in Raqqa. The rear guard was severely mangled in the fighting, but a few dozen survivors managed to reach Topka Air Base in mid-August. During the battle for the base, casualties for both sides amount to approximately 105 Syrian army soldiers and 28 ISIS fighters. The capture of the Division 17 base was the first domino to fall in a string of victories over government troops that would solidify ISIS control of northeast Syria.